it forward. Yan ang pakay ng Filipino Olympic figure skater na si Michael Martinez sa kanyang pagbabalik dito sa bansa. Matapos niyang humakot ang sunod-sunod na honors sa mga international skating competitions, gusto naman ngayon turuan ni Michael ang mga susunod na herasyon ng figure skater sa bansa with his series of skating camps. At makakasama natin ngayon sa studio ang kababayan natin, the first Filipino Olympian in the Winter Olympics and the first Southeast Asian in the Winter Olympics, Michael Martinez. Welcome to The Score. Thank you so much for having me here. Uh, <laughs> siguro off the bat, Michael, um, we are still uh, in awe of yung stature mo. Uh, can you tell us what is it like to be able to compete in, in the Olympics and in the World uh, Figure Skating Championships? Grabe, uh, yung when I first competed in the Winter Olympics sa so 2014, iba yung feeling super saya ko noon kasi sabi ko, lahat ng pinaghirapan ko all those years paid off. Mm -hmm. So yeah. Grabe. So, tinanong ni Marco, what does it feel to be in the Olympics? Ang tanong ko naman, what does it take to be in the oh, Olympics? Wow. Kinikwento mo sa amin, Michael, <laughs> na 10 hours, 10 hours a day, 6 days a week ka nag yes. Pakikwento naman sa ating mga viewers <laughs> kung ano ba ang ginagawa mo sa 10 oras sa isang araw. Ayun, so, I train 10 hours a day, okay. uh, 6 times a week, and uh, I skate 5 to 6 hours and I do workout for 2 hours and then 1 hour dance and then 1 hour uh, therapy. So, yeah, every day. Yun. <laughs> every single day, walang, walang sawa. <laughs> Pero right now, Michael, it has uh, paid off. You are ranked yes. 29th in the world. world and and uh, in this season, you said you're ranked 23. 23. Out of 144 skaters. Wow. Grabe yung, uh, <laughs> grabe yung stature na yun. And, um, tell us, uh, you're based currently you're training in the US but yes. right now you're here visiting the Philippines uh, tell us what is uh, what are the activities lined up yeah. uh, that you have well I just finished with uh, the camp uh, skating camp uh, last week and the skating show now what's next for me is the I'll be doing a skating uh, camp and show too in Cebu on July 1 and July 2 where exactly in in mm. Cebu Michael and uh, what uh, bakit mo na isipan na mag-conduct ng skills or skating camps uh, it will be in uh, Seaside Cebu, uh, SM, and uh, well, I ko kasi it it's been always my dream to be able to impart my knowledge to the kids, mm -hmm. naman po, and, and to be able to uh, help them and yeah to realize that oh this is what I really want. Para sa Michael, nagcompete ka na on the international stage. You put the Philippines on the map based on yung mga nakasama mo sa inyong mga camps. Uh, naikita mo ba na pweding mas umangat pa? ang Marami. Pilipinas sa uh, mundo when it comes to ice yes. skating? Yes, mm. there's a lot of uh, talented and mm. skaters there, especially yung current nating skaters. Mm -hmm. dami. I'm really, really happy. <laughs> you, you, you mentioned that you started when you were nine years old. Yes. Uh, paano mo na isipan na of all sports, bakit figure skating? Well, at first I did, I tried basketball, I tried swimming, and then uh, it didn't, didn't work. So I, me and my sister, do, uh, we were in a Yam Yamaha voice lesson. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Then after noon, like, switch came in, then I saw the rink, and then I tried it, and then something. And then I fell in love with it when I first tried it. Mm -hmm. and then you know, na. <laughs> you're very young, Michael, but you're very intelligent as well. You're you're looking ahead. You're thinking about your future. And mo Marco 2018 is already on your mind. So yes. what are the necessary steps for you to be able to compete there in the 2018 Winter Olympics? And um, ano sa tingin mo ang mga kailangan mong improve from your previous appearance in the 2014 Olympics? Right now, we have a new, I have a new program po for the next season. Mm. And there's so many things that I, that I can improve for the next season. And uh, especially in choreography, yung dance-wise, yung kamay, more power, more energy more strength in mga landings, sa jumps, more perf perfect ko pa po yung mga triple jumps ko po and to be able to land a quad jump. Actually, I have the quad jump, just I just need to land it. Yeah, ah. Kompleto na. So, yeah. Naalala ko, Marco, kasi quinento ni Michael, yung, yung quad jump. Uh, but that was a year ago. So, para lang sa mga viewers, uh, an ano ba itong uh, quad jump? Na, ano, yes, uh, uh, there's uh, a lot of different, uh, there's different uh, types of quad jumps, but I'm doing this the first one, the pinyakam uh, ababang quad jump, which is the quad toe loop. You jump and you use your toe to jump and turn and for rotations. But yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Yung palang medyo <laughs> hindi kahit tayo hindi na natin may imagine mm. partner. But Michael, part of the preparations para dito sa Olympics is the Asian Figure Skating yes. Trophy, if I'm not mistaken. Yes. Uh, when is that going to be? Where is it going to be held? 
Yes, uh, it will be held here on August 4 to 7. Mm -hmm. uh, I haven't checked on which rink will it be, or some mega mall or some mall of Asia. So but yeah. it is going to be a, a world class competition yes. that uh, Filipinos can can see you perform. Yes, in. yes, and of course some of our uh, national champion skaters from last year will be competing there also. Mm. And then next year, there are Sea Games. Yes, yes. Uh, August. Yes, I'll be doing Sea Games mm. and uh, Asian Winter Games, and then most important one for me. Uh, is the World Championship, which is the qualifying event for the Olympics. So that is the big one before, before yes. the Olympics. When is that going to be, Michael? March na po sa Finland. Wow. Okay, yeah. so... Malapit na. <laughs> <laughs> well, we, we wish you the best of luck, Michael. Thank you. Ano, huling mensay sa lahat ng mga nanonood ngayon. Um, invite them, invite to, them yeah. to the camps. Yes, uh, I would like to invite everyone to try the skating camp in Cebu. Uh, it's really easy and... Uh, you might love it and you might succeed in this sport and uh, I also want to say that uh, don't uh, always take the first step and don't be scared and uh, stay humble pray and uh, yeah that's it <laughs> Michael uh, before we let you go uh -huh. uh, this skating camp is it uh, open to the public yes. what do they need to do to to sign up and uh, are there people you want you want to thank oh yes I want to thank SM for doing all this and since 2014 I was able to reach my dream. Thank you SM and uh, um, for, uh, for the skaters, uh, everybody can join from any age and uh, you just need to bring uh, I guess uh, training mats, training um, shoes for the warm-up mm -hmm. area. Oh, yeah. Ah, okay. So, partner, can we pala tayo? <laughs> yes! <laughs> Please join. <laughs> but of course, uh, Michael, thank you very much for joining us. It's not often that we have yeah, an Olympian yeah. on our show. So, thank you for joining us. Thank you very much for coming back here for the second time. Pleasure. For more sports updates, keep watching The Score. And don't forget to subscribe.